twice, thank you. You've been very helpful, ma'am. Pouch. Pouch. <gasps> Nothing. Darn it. Well, there's something powered over there. Is that the wall of light? Did I make it all the way across already? There's a tumbler here. <laughs> they advertise for them as well. Knock him out because that will forfeit that 900 gold, and I don't want to do that. I haven't saved since then. I hit it again. I haven't saved since then and completely screwed myself, have I? No, I'm so good. Oh, wait, what was the other thing I needed to do? I need an address book. What's the other one? Something in a lockbox. I think they're all in lockboxes, aren't they? That looks bad. It's electromacute. There's nothing under the stairs. Okay, I'm, I'm stuck. Oh, 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 did you? Oh, no, you didn't. All right, uninstalling. Don't want to play this game anymore. <laughs> there always has to be something underneath the stairs. Oh, this sucks. That's too many numbers. Numbers are evil. Numbers. I don't think the hook mines will do anything to them. More tumblers and safes. Oh, you were already sleeping. Yeah, that tartlet. Um. Ah, there it is. Red Bone Charm. Risky Per Perry. Probably has something to do with sword fighting, perhaps. Let's see. Corrupted. Risky Perry. During melee combat, your sword always parry always knocks on an enemy down. You take damage when parrying. That would be bad. Doctor Galvani's memoirs. Well, here we go. Uh, did I read that? I think I already, yeah, I already read that. So I did know what it was. Twenty-eighth day of the month, high cold. Don't hit your head on that. What else in here? But it was a good reminder. Whoa, whoa. Hey, uh, thank you. Important, do not forget. A whole bunch of codes. Ooh. PA system shortening. Get pylons recalibrated. Yeah, they were a little iffy. File folders. Flowers. Sparkling fig wine. Audiograph. And candles. This is what I needed. Shit. Yeah, if 
if I open these, is it gonna make noise? Because then I can't get the ones near him, which is a problem. Oh, it is bright up here. So this is where the safety deposit boxes are. Michael's Bank wishes you a profitable day. Thank you, I appreciate it. Okay, so Galvani. Um did it say in what I just picked up? Important, do not forget. Oh, this is something different, never mind. Uh, but I do think I know Galvani's. So just tell me because that'd be so much easier. No, it doesn't, of course it doesn't. That would be too easy. Dr. Galvani's memoir. 28th day of the month of high cold. So it's something 28. I don't know what the month of high cold is. Or not. It would be 28 and then the day. Or then the month. On their primary Michael's account and a set of Sabilla cooking knives. Join today. Do I get a toaster? And Associates offers the best security in the aisle. Electrified floor. It does. <laughs> Sorry, Galvani. You don't really believe. You don't really need this. On Birdie the Bird. <laughs> he named the bird. I caught Birdie as we came to call him on one of those ill-fated expeditions to Pandicia, which I and a few others attempt, attempted from time to time to follow in the footsteps of the great Sokolov. The birds assemble in great flocks and nests in the cliffside. He had flown too close to our ship, and so one of the sailors snared him with a well-thrown net, and we managed to cage him. He was the first of his species to reach Gristolian shores. He caused a stir in the popular imagination when I first displayed him. I did a circuit of public lectures on Pandician fauna, and each theater was packed with people hopeful for a glimpse of my little bird. I heard from some friends that Bertie even featured in some children's literature with fanciful illustrations. After a time, Bertie grew quite tame. He would even accept grapes from my hand. Sadly, he died after just a few short years, but he inspired a passion of Pandician birds, egg collecting, and taxidermy. I had him stuffed, and occasionally I charged a small fee to allow viewers to see him. He will always hold a special place in my heart. Can I take him? I'd like to take him. Okay, what else we got? Yun. Do I have Yuns? I wish I could search my stuff. It's been so long since I picked stuff up over by Yun's. Unset letter to him. That wouldn't have it, or would it? No. Sean Yun's diary. My darling Eleni believes the lock. Oh, that no, that's his lock at home. I don't remember. Maybe I'll find it somewhere else. Well, thank you for. Yun and Christoph. I have both their keys, but I don't know if I know their codes yet. You don't come in here, do you? Good. Because that would be bad. Yeah. Turn all this crap off. Interesting how I said, let's turn all this crap off, and she falls in the water instead of jumping. Very interesting. I have enough to jump here. Well, that worked. I guess it wasn't actually electrified, it was just like miniature arc pylons. Okay. Ooh. No, it doesn't. Shut up. All right, so this is another way that it could uh, come down. Starting a commercial venture. 
Michaels and Associates can help. Go away, I want to see what's in here. Saying of the week. The best things in life are expensive. Start saving today. The Sentinel will now scout the area and rescue no, no. Shit. Woke people up. I wasn't sneaking and I forgot that those things can hear. Oh well. Get under there. How? Okay, whatever. Somehow it was seeing me. All right. Um. I don't even know where I would find those codes. I might have found them earlier, but going back and looking for them is just tedious. I'll do that later. I know those are the things I can do right now. That's good. See a clockwork soldier. No admittance without authorization code. Direct line. Does that mean I have to speak it? Yeah. Note to Anselm. Dear Anselm, I know the first day on the job can be trying, so feel free to ask me any questions. Remember the code for this door changes, so you'll have to get the new one from Chief Penna, which I got downstairs. You can usually find him in the archives, which I did. Once you have the code, speak the numbers clearly into the microphone and wait for the lock to release. I'll come by at noon and take you to my favorite restaurant. Most of us security guards go there for lunch. The food's terrible, but it keeps our interest low. There's a little bank humor for the you. What? It keeps our interest low. Huh? I, I didn't get your bank humor. See you later, Martin. All right, let's do it. Hey, wake up. I need you to let me in. No. Huh? Outsider's eyes. If Pena caught me sleeping on the job, he'd make me run the shock block. <clears throat> May I have the code, please? It's B15D. Now let me in. Okay, okay. Come on in. And uh, I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell Chief Pena about my attention maps. Everyone gives me a hard time about the codes. I don't make the rules. It's blocked, so I can't even get in there. Okay. So I'm assuming he's in there somewhere. Okay. At least I was able to come in. I didn't know if he was going to actually physically come to the door. That would have been bad. If they didn't forget the codes, we wouldn't have a problem. Oh, what the hell? There's freedom being hated. There's license being cast out. Someone is listening too well. Okay. Very quiet. These things can still hear. Already read this. Hi guys, how you doing? Electrified floor. That's not good. And bullets! More Lucky Saltpeter. Everybody fucking has Lucky Saltpeter. Start licking that saltpeter and see how lucky it is. Ah, so it's just the locker room. Gotcha. Thank you. <gasps> Fish scales! That's what I always done wanted. Ooh, lockpick. I don't think I can use that. Lockpicks are too loud to use when you're trying to be quiet. Maybe I should play around with the typewriter. Man, there's so much stuff in here. 